Doctor appointment websites have drastically improved the efficiency and convenience of booking medical visits. They're convenient because they eliminate the hassle of traditional phone calls, offer instant confirmations, and provide access to a broader range of healthcare professionals. It could be a real game changer for an individual medical practitioner. It could also be a great way to start a business if you're looking for a full fledged marketplace of doctors. So, today, we will show you how to create such a platform using WordPress in next to no time. In this tutorial, we'll use Meeting Hive, a modern appointment booking WordPress theme, and HivePress, a versatile WordPress directory plugin with all the needed features. So, let's start. Let's begin by installing the theme. In your WordPress dashboard, go to the Appearance, Themes, Add New Theme section. Here, click on the Upload Theme button and upload the Meeting Hive zip file. Then, install and activate the theme. Once Meeting Hive is installed, you'll be suggested to install recommended plugins, including HivePress. These plugins are crucial for enabling all the features on your website, so simply follow the provided link to install and activate them. Now, we need to make the website structured and easy to navigate. Thus, let's add different medical categories for users to choose from. To add a new category, go to the Listings, Categories section. Here, you can name your category, describe it, pick a suitable icon, and assign a color. You can also create a category hierarchy by selecting the parent one. When finished, press Add Category. I added for medical categories, but you can add as many as you need for your doctor booking website by following the same steps. Next, you should add some listing fields to let doctors provide useful information about their services. With Meeting Hive, you can add your own custom fields and search filters, and the number is unlimited. For instance, let's create a free consultation field that will help clients indicate whether a particular doctor offers a free first consultation. To create a new custom field, go to the listings, attributes, add new, and name the field. Then, you can customize your listing field in three different contexts, editing, search, and display. In the editing section, mark your field as editable so doctors can fill it in when they list their service. Next, you'll need to choose the field type. We're going to use the select field type because we only want one option to be picked. Lastly, decide if you want this field to be required and set your moderation preferences. In the search section, you can turn the field into a search filter to allow patients filter listings, so let's mark this field as filterable to make it show up in the listing filter form. For the field type, it would be best to use Select again. In the Display section, you can choose which template areas you want your field to show up in, as well as set the display format using available tokens. Also, you can choose a suitable icon for it to display. For instance, let's say we want to set Block, Ternary, and Page, Ternary, as display areas and use this display format. But if you would like to show the icon instead, use the icon token. When you're done, hit the Publish button. After this, you should notice a new Edit Options button. We'll follow it to add two simple options, yes and no. That's it. From now on, you'll see this field in the listing submission form. Don't forget to add other important fields, like contact number or specialties. OK, the listing fields are up. However, patients still need to know a bit more about each doctor before they decide whether to book an appointment with them, so it'd be a good idea to add vendor profile fields, too. Anyway, it's the same process as for the listing fields. For example, let's create an education field so doctors can share information about which university they graduated from. You can do this in the vendors, attributes, add new page. Just a heads up, for this particular field, it's better to choose a text field type in the editing section since there are too many universities out there, so doctors will have to write the university name manually. Also, it's not necessary to make such a field searchable. Feel free to add other doctor profile fields. Let's move on. Meeting Hive comes with six high press extensions right out of the box. Nonetheless, if you want to enhance the functionality of your doctor appointment platform even further, you can add some extra features by installing other HivePress add-ons. There are more than 15 HivePress extensions that are fully compatible with each other. You can find them in the HivePress extensions section. For example, you might want to install the Social Login add-on, which allows users to log in via third-party platforms. Social links that will let doctors add social links to their listings and profiles might also come in handy. Additionally, the geolocation extension will allow users to find doctors based on their location. 
To install an extension, simply click the Install button and then activate it. Now, be sure to visit the High Press, Settings section and go through all the settings. This is a really important step to ensure everything works the way you need it to. Also, bear in mind that the number of settings goes up with each new extension you add, so if you decide to install some additional High Press add-ons, don't forget to check their settings. Here, we'll quickly go over some of the basics. By default, the front-end listing submission is enabled in the Listings tab, but you can uncheck this option if you want your platform to be single vendor, meaning that only the admin will be able to add listings. If you want to allow doctors to sign up as vendors and submit their service listings, leave this option checked. Additionally, you can disable manual listing moderation here. If you're aiming for a multi-vendor platform, you should note that by default, HivePress requires users to add at least one listing to become a vendor. Thus, in the Vendors tab, there's an option to enable direct vendor registration, which will let doctors sign up as vendors right away. Then, you should definitely review settings in the Bookings tab, because that's where the appointment functionality is located. For example, we'll enable time-based booking slots so that patients can book appointments throughout the day. Link to the detailed guides on how to set up bookings and all the other extensions is in the video description, be sure to check it to review all the settings and set everything up according to your needs. We'll move on to the next step, which is creating a homepage for your doctor appointment website. Meeting Hive is built right into Gutenberg, so we don't have to worry about coding and can just use blocks to get the job done. So, head over to Pages, add new page and name the newly created page Home. From here, we'll begin designing the home page's layout. Let's start by writing the header text that will catch users' attention. Then, you can start adding different Hive Press blocks. Simply click the plus icon and type high press in the search bar to see all of them. For example, below the heading, let's add the listing search form and listing categories blocks. You can also adjust these blocks using the settings column on the right. Once you're done, click publish. Next, head over to the dashboard, settings, reading section and set this page as your home page by selecting it from the drop down list. Also, your future blog page should be assigned here as well. Now, you can visit your site and see that it takes you right to the home page. Keep in mind that you can always make more adjustments to your site's appearance if you wish to. At the moment, we definitely need to upgrade the look and feel, so let's click Customize and go through all the sections. In the Site Identity section, you can customize several key aspects of your site, like logo, title, tagline, icon, copyright notice. Let's set the logo. Select your file, crop it if needed, and upload. It looks decent. Now, hit Publish and let's move to the next section. In the Colors section, you can tweak the primary and secondary colors to match your brand's aesthetic. Next, let's add an attractive header image. Click on Header Image, then Add New, and upload your chosen image. The site is already looking more appealing. In the Menus section, you can set up and customize menus for different areas of your website. Let's add a blog page to the header menu as an example. Ensure you have a blog page created and set as the Posts page, similar to how we set up the home page. Click Create New Menu, name it, and assign it to Header. Then, click Add Items, Pages, and choose your blog page. Now, your blog is accessible to users. Also, if you've enabled direct vendor registration, it's important to add a direct doctor registration link to your site. To do this, click Add Items, then Custom Links. Fill in the URL field using this structure, your domain slash register vendor, and name the link. Great, this will allow doctors to sign up in one click. Press Publish to save your changes and let's continue. The Widgets section allows you to add custom widgets to various parts of your site. While optional, they can be useful for displaying extra content. In the Home Page Settings section, you can define your Home Page and Posts page, which we've already set up. The Fonts section provides a variety of font options to personalize your site's typography, so you can play around with fonts. Lastly, the Additional CSS section is where you can add custom CSS code snippets to further customize your site's appearance. Refer to the video description for pre-made PHP and CSS snippets specifically designed for Hive Press. Now, let's review the home page again. 
It definitely looks more polished and professional. At this point, the key functions of your doctor appointment platform should be working, so let's start testing them. We'll begin by creating a doctor profile. Simply follow the doctor registration link. You'll see that the registration form includes custom vendor fields you created earlier. Simply fill out all the fields and proceed by clicking Save Changes. After the profile is created, our doctor is ready to publish a service listing. Adding a listing is a breeze. You just need to press the List to Service button located in the top right corner and fill out the submission form. Note that this form is fully customizable and consists mainly of your created custom fields. However, there are some default ones, like title and description, and those added by different high press add ons, like bookings or tags. Once you've filled in all the details, just click the Submit Listing button and the listing will be sent off for review. Then, an admin can either approve or reject it in the WP Dashboard Listings section. But as we said, if you don't want to approve listings manually, you can turn off moderation in the High Press Settings Listings section. Once it's been approved, the listing will show up on the front end. Congrats, we've made it to the last checkpoint. Now, doctors can easily register on your platform and post their services with a few clicks. Finally, let's take a look at how patients can book appointments. On the listing page, simply set the desired date and time, then hit Book Now. You'll be redirected to the confirmation page. Here, patients can check their bookings and write additional comments. The Confirm Booking button finishes the process. And that's how it works. The doctor will be able to see the booking in their profile dashboard. On top of that, MeetingHive's built-in calendar feature will be a real time saver for doctors, letting them manage their availability with ease. They'll be able to block specific dates and times, which will help them control their schedules more effectively. Well, seems like we did the job and the platform is functioning. In addition, let's discuss how you can make money from your platform. Please note that to access monetization features and get payments going, you'll need to install WooCommerce and a few HivePress extensions. One of the easiest monetization ways is to charge a commission on each appointment booked on your website. To do this, you'll need to install the HivePress Marketplace extension, which is included with the Meeting Hive theme. Just download it from your purchase email and install it in the Dashboard, Plugins, Add New, Upload Plugin section. Once you've installed it, just go to High Press, Settings, Vendors, where you can set up your commission structure. You can set a commission rate like 5%, a flat commission fee like $5, or even both at the same time. You can also apply these commissions to customers by adjusting the same settings in the Users tab. Yes, you can charge both doctors and patients too, that's up to you. Another really effective way to make money is to charge doctors for adding listings. With the HivePress Paid Listings extension, you can create different listing packages with different prices. For instance, you could offer a free package that lets doctors add only one service listing and a premium package that increases the number of possible listings. First, we need to create WooCommerce product. Go to WooCommerce, Products, Add New. Provide a name, such as Premium Package, Set the Price, and market is virtual. After this, click Publish. Next, we need to add some listing packages to charge doctors when they add new listings. Go to Listings, Packages, and click Add New. We'll add free and premium packages and start with the premium one. Name the package, add a description, and specify the number of listings allowed. You can also set the listing expiration period. Then, select the WooCommerce product created earlier. Finally, click Publish. In the same way, add a free package without selecting a WooCommerce product. Now, let's test it by going to our website and clicking the List a Service button. After clicking the Submit Listing button, you'll be redirected to the Package Selection page. If you select the Premium Package, you'll be taken to the Checkout page. And that's how you can charge doctors for adding new listings. Finally, the same paid listings extension will also allow doctors to promote their services for a certain fee. It's a tried and true way of making money that you can find on many websites. Featured listings appear at the top of search results, giving doctors more visibility and increasing their chances of booking. So, it's definitely a win-win option. Simply create another WooCommerce product for featured listings. It should be virtual too. 
publish it, then go to Hive Press, Settings, Listings, and select this WooCommerce product to be used for the featured status in the corresponding field. You can also set the featuring period here. After saving changes, you can check how it works. Go to your website, visit the user dashboard, and click on the star icon next to any listing to make it featured. As you see, you'll be redirected to the checkout page. Congrats, now you're ready to start monetizing your doctor appointment platform. And that's a wrap on our tutorial. We hope you found it helpful and now feel ready to start your own doctor appointment platform. If you're still not sure which theme to go for, we'd highly recommend Meeting Hive. It's got all the features you need right out of the box, so you can start building your platform in no time.